There are two interesting uh, loop controls in Perl, next and last. The way they work, the, as we'll see now. Uh, here we have a, a, a script that opens a file, a spe actually it opens itself. So $0 if you remember, that's always the path to the current script. So $0 will contain the path to the cor current script and we are trying to open it now for reading or die, that's just in case something is really bad. And then we, we go over the all the line, all the lines and count something. What do we count? So we jump the line, that's okay, remo remove the end of the line, end of uh, the new line. Then we check whether the line is equal to underscore underscore end underscore underscore. If it is, then we call last. Last will jump to the end of the loop and finish running the loop. So as you can see here, there is an end block, end, end, no, not block, sorry, an end mark. So once we reach reading the, this part, we will actually skip the whole, the rest of the code, the rest of the file. Then here we say, if the line is empty, so when you are reading and if there is an empty line, just, just go to the next iteration, meaning jump here, actually jump to the end of the, the block and then again evaluate the condition, meaning read another line and then evaluate whether it's true or not. And if it's true, then execute again the whole uh, loop. So next we'll do the next iteration and last we'll finish this iteration and finish the whole loop. It's uh, like last is usually, I think in other languages, is break and next is continue. And then if uh, we haven't reached this one and nor this one, then we arrive to this point. So all the lines up until the end line that has some content that are not totally empty will be will arrive here and we'll print them out with, uh, um, with a new line at the end as with two um, quotes, single quotes around the line and then we also uh, uh, increase the counter so that at the end we can print out how many non-empty rows, rows we found. So let, let's just see how it works. If I switch to the screen, uh, if I run the loop controls, then it will print out the content of its own content but it will remove all the empty rows, if you see, remember, between the condition, between the two ifs, there were a couple of empty rows, they are not printed now, this is printed because there is some text here, and then we don't see the end part and anything beyond, and the number of rows up till here is 20. So we learned how to use last, which is breaking out from the current loop, and next which is doing this the, the next iteration of the of the loop